Welcome to a wave a day 2020. You've seen me surf every season, every day of a month. Right here, we've done summer, we've done winter, spring, fall, autumn, all the seasons, all five of them. But this is a beach break, not great. But there is a better break right here at Kalbara Beach. It's the northern end of the beach. It's a point break. I wanted to get better before I tackled that break because that's where all the great surfers are. But I feel like it might be time to step up. So for the month of February, I'm gonna be hitting the northern point of Kalbara Beach every day, a wave a day style. I'm still riding the 7S Superfish version 4 from Global Surf Industries. Thank you, Global Surf Industries. I'm still waxing it up with Bell Surf Wax. Thank you, Bell Surf Wax. I'm not gonna be using the Arzen wetsuits. Thank you, Arzen. Because it's summer! I'm just gonna wear boardies, right? It's summer here in Australia. So if you like the idea of seeing me trying to cut it with the boys and the girls on the northern point of Kalbara Beach, come back daily for a Wave a day, summer edition 2020! Hello the internet, it is Wednesday the 19th of February 2020, wave 19 of my wave a day project summer edition. Do you feel the wind coming behind me? That's offshore, that's from the west. That usually makes great waves, look at this. What? That's offshore. That's right here at the front. Of course, this project, see you later, hat. The northern point of Kalbara Beach, three kilometers away. Let's get my hat and then let's take a stroll. northern point of Kalbara Beach. I'm looking at both the points for the left. There's a couple of dudes out there getting that left. But I'm also watching this right-hander come through here. Look at this, watch this guy. Okay, that's a bad example. What's gonna happen behind it? Look at that little rise up. Now, because it's offshore, both this right and that left is working. The only concern with the left is you do take off right on the point. I don't know how skilled I am for that at this point in my surfing career. I'm kind of thinking this right. I can't decide. I'll take some time to make a decision. Upon closer inspection and upon uh, watching and enjoying the two gentlemen that are out there surfing right now, I've made a decision. I'm gonna hit this right. The section coming through here, the left that they're, they're taking, yeah, it's not very consistent. It also needs to be really large so it doesn't hit that rock, take off on the side of it. Um, I've just watched them for about, well, I watched them for the whole daily vlog and then a few minutes before, so about six, seven minutes worth. And I haven't really seen too much action. But here, whilst it's closing out, there is definitely a potential for a nice barrel here. Look this. Potential there, okay. Let's go surfing! Eye for an eye And we all go blind A man once said this And he would ride And he would ride Well, good morning, Wednesday! You think I made the right choice coming to this right hand section? Just getting my breath back, but there's some definite nice waves coming through here. Here's the day. Okay, so I've had a I've had a crack at one. Not so good. Uh, the idea here is consistently doing what I gotta do tuck into some kind of barrel. That's the plan today. Come on in. Come on in. So I guess that's an example of what not to do. I don't know what I did wrong. It's a nice size wave. I thought I was in the right takeoff position. And uh, I just tumbled all the way down. Let's do the right thing. Let's show the world. So the world can. 
decent wave. Like I can't tell if I just cooped it or was it a bad selection? I'm not sure. Um, I want another one though, that's absurd. I did better on that one. Probably a better wave selection too. Had a bit of a face to it. Kind of like a bit of an A-frame. Yeah, I think I did better. Not great, but better. Yes! Wow, that felt rad. I really uh, consciously thought about pushing my back foot down and trying to slow down the wave. That was a nice sized wave. Potential for a barrel. I watched the lip, I was like, back up a little, back up. Push my right foot down on the back of the board, slow the speed up, and try to sit up there in that pocket. I didn't achieve it, but it felt good. Come on, come on. expecting a left like that. Hello, hello. Like I said, I'm not here for the left, but uh, I just popped up right in front of me. Well, I reckon I made the right choice there. I mean, that's still a potential wave there. Okay, look, I didn't do so well. I enjoyed putting the brakes on that one. The wave kind of curled up in front of me. That was a good feeling. Good proof of concept. My last wave wasn't too bad either. Every wave I take is a learning step, is it not? So if you enjoyed seeing me taking learning steps, come back tomorrow for Wave A Day Part 20. Wow, it's a beautiful break, isn't it? The Northern Point of Culborough Beach, yeah. If you enjoyed that content, please, please, please do me a solid. Check out my sponsors down below, Global Surf Industries, Bell Surf Wax, Ours and Wetsuits. And if you enjoyed this content and you think you might want to subscribe, hit the old subscribe button right here. You can also check out my previous wave here. You can check out a random vlog of mine, may or may not be surf related, right here. If you want to support me financially, Patreon right there. Otherwise, enjoy the content and I'll see you tomorrow.